I've been using OBS to record my tutorials and it works, but every time I want to explain something simple to a client, I end up re-recording scenes, adding zooms in post, editing timelines like a madman for a 3 minutes video, and then I thought, uh, what if, what if there's an app that does, does it for me, something clean, simple, fast, but still looks professional, that's how I stumbled on this app, I haven't used it yet, but if it can do what I think it can, it might miss, it might save me hours. All right, so let's see what this thing can do. Okay, so this is the the website. So video creation without the hustle. Okay, so get started for Apple Silicon. Okay, so let's call this open. We're almost ready to create amazing videos. We just need to set up a couple of things. So get started and or a quick recording. Okay, I'll start with this one. Let's see. So start writing your amazing video. How? Let's see how to record screen recording on Mac OS. Oh, and now this is the first scene. Okay, now I can click on here, record. Oh, okay. And I can select my microphone. Okay, I can select the camera, turn off screen, and then I can just start recording. Let's click on record and retake. You have your script here. So let's play the audio. Delete take. Oh, we can also see all the takes. Well, that's that's helpful. And if I want to delete this scene, I can. Oh, here I can go and enter the script. Oh yeah, of course. I have the script. I can record the new take. I have to retake a couple of scenes. Okay. Yeah. I... A lot of uh, situations. Yeah. Let's save this and let's see what we can do. Can I edit? Okay, you can actually. Yeah. Yeah, of course, because it says edit. So let's continue, continue. Just but where are the auto zooms? Because that's what I want. Oh, here's the transcript. Oh, I like that. So I can just delete this. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I like this. That's very helpful. You can cut, control B to cut. Okay. But where is the zoom? Add screen zoom. And do I have to add them automatically? In a lot of... Oh, okay, but like this zoom is uh, zoom focus cursor. Where I just have to record it. just a drag a circle to select focal point. Ah, okay, okay, and how the zoom looks like? Where I just have to record it. If it's too long, the zoom, I can decrease. I like that I can also have a background. Oh, I can also edit this. Oh, that's cool. And the camera, I can move the camera. Yeah, let's go back to audio. Select, I can select the audio. Oh, you can also remove the noise. Hmm. In a lot of yeah, so here there's no noise. And here there is noise, so I can... I like this. Now the layout, I can also change the layout. Okay. So I have the camera and the desktop. But what about the canvas? Oh, this also click video video format. So I can do this for TikTok, even though I'm not gonna use that that much. And we have the background. I like this how it looks. It's it's like just looks pretty professional like this. The background. So wonder if I can add some shadow. I don't think I can add shadow color. Just a color or just a gradient. Yeah. And then export custom 4K. Okay, so another thing that I find, it said on the website I can export to Premiere Pro if I want. So, because I usually use Premiere Pro to edit my videos, so that'll be grateful. That'll, that'll be great. So, export timeline format. And yeah, I can export to Premiere Pro. Export, open, yeah, so I have the, the file, so I can export to Premiere Pro.